We are back! Hold on, I need to take a phone call first. Alright, Todd. I know it's been a while. What are you doing? Look, look, Todd. I know. Alright, I was busy. I went to go do... Just because I'm a Pokemon trainer doesn't mean I need to spend every single day of my life training Pokemon. I can take a vacation every now and then, Todd. My golem is looking more and more like me. It's getting cuter. Well, you know what? Your golem is ugly, and so are you, Todd. All right, that was mean. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to tell you that, Todd. I, I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm going through a lot of crap right now. I got the shit beat out of me by the Elite Four, you know. I should challenge the Golden Rod Gym. That's great. Okay, Todd, have fun with that. All right. Ah. Uh, okay, so it's been a while. Um... You know, I, I lost the Nuzlocke, all right? Just just to recap events to see where we're at right now, okay? I took on the Elite Four. I got my ass kicked. I, I, I lost everybody. And so the Nuzlocke came to an end. But normally the, the game would just end there. However, there's so much additional crap in this game, uh, Crystal Clear, that uh, I always wanted to get back to it someday. I, I wanted to first, I wanted to take on the Elite Four properly and defeat them. That's something I wanted to do. And something else I wanted to do is, you know, see all the extra little stuff you can do. Like, for example, in regular Crystal and in Gen 2, you defeat the Elite Four, and then you go and get the Kanto badges, and then you eventually can fight Red atop Mount Silver. Well, there is something similar to that here, but it, it's not exactly the same. So I wanted to try that. Um, I wanted to take on the other um, gyms. Because the gyms will scale based on you. So, for instance, I don't remember what the first gym we took on was. I think the first gym we battled was, um... Was it... What what town did we start in? I don't even remember where we started. I want to say it was Brock. I want to say we started in Pallet Town. We started in Kanto, and our first gym was Brock. Well, anyway, the point is... If we were to fight, like, um, Claire... As our first opponent, which we could have done, Claire would have pretty weak Pokémon based on the level and stuff. However, if we waited to the very end to battle, like, a weak trainer like Brock, like, if Brock was the last person we fought, Brock would have, like, insanely high-level Pokémon. Like, they scale with you. So, I want to take on the other gym leaders and see what they have in store. Um, but for right now, I... I I wanted to show you my Pokemon. So all of our Pokemon are back here now. We have everybody at level 100. I just used the cheat to get everybody maxed out. So, uh... I think, uh, I, I have a feeling we're gonna do a little bit better in the Elite Four now. Although, who knows? It might not be a guarantee. Because here's the downside. I have, like, no full restores or super potions or anything. And I also have, like, no money. So, we're still kind of at a disadvantage here. Um. Alright, let's go through everybody. Helgamesh is back. We got Flamethrower, Shadow Ball, Crunch, and Fire Blast. Kermit, we got Psychic, Blizzard, Surf, and Rain Dance. Spark Plug's got Swift, Thundershock, Thunder Wave, and Thunder. Thunderbolt. There's a reason why I didn't teach at Thunderbolt. Maybe I can't find the TM or something. I don't know. Take down Dream Eater Fly, Hypnosis, Aerosmith. We got Dragon Breath, Ancient Power, Earthquake, and Hyper Beam. And uh, where's Mandragora? I think Mandragora was at the top. Mandragora has Giga Drain, Sleep Powder, Toxic, and Solar Beam. Okay. All right. All right. Level 100, still at a disadvantage. Yep. That's how it goes. Huh. All right, so uh, let's head over to Indigo Plateau and let's see if we can uh, do a little better than last time. Oh, Nux is our flyer, not Aerosmith. That's the reason we have Nux is because I didn't want to teach Aerosmith fly. All right, here we go, guys. Rematch time. Now, I think we made... Didn't we make it to the second member of the Elite Four last time? I think we're doing pretty... We did, we did okay with the first person just heal up to make sure. All right. I would buy some full restorers, but I have no money. I have $3,000. I could buy a max potion. I will take one max potion, sir. 
And I all right. Here we go. Welcome to the Indigo. Oh, you're that kid that died last time. Well, hold on a click. All right, here we go. Lock in. Oh boy. It's been quite a while since any trainer collected eight chimp badges. Man, the quality of trainers in this region must really suck then. Sir Roth has come here to issue a challenge to us, the Elite Four. Well then, let us prepare. I especially look forward to seeing how good you are. Oh. I don't know which one of them was speaking, but it sounded very creepy. And then there's that dude that's just like, Whoa, where am I? Where am I? All right. We, we don't get to choose, I think, who we fight first. Yeah. All right. So do they just have all those little doors just to pop in and, like, take my measure? And then they just like, all right, well, those are our little balcony peepholes. Here we go. All right. Now, here's the thing. One great thing about this Elite Four is that, uh, from what we found out last time, is they're not type-specific, which is great, because you'd figure, like, you know, the Elite Four wouldn't just be like, All right, well, I have nothing but fire Pokémon, so just throw out a water type and you'll be good. Uh, no, this is, this is gonna be fun. So, who do I have out in front? Mandragora, I think. All right. I forget what he... I think he leads with a Tangela. I'll throw Helgamesh out first. I think he leads with a Tangela. All right, let's rock and roll. It's time I get a little bit of payback. I've made this room look more natural. My Pokemon helped me keep it watered. Let's rock and roll. Okay, I get- I don't care about your backstory! All right. All right. TLDR, Robert, TLDR. And now you die. Alright. Oh, I love this thing. Oh, I remember this theme, man. 1956. That was a good year. Eisenhower was president. Korean War was going on. That's not good. But I love this theme. Dark against normal. That makes sense! Crunch! Oh, I love the animation of Crunch! I just put it in its freak. I just put this wiggly tuff in my jaws and just... These Pokemon are all dead, by the way. Alright. Poison ground. All right. Uh, Kermit, how about you switch out for this? Rising up. Back on the street. Oh, I might be able to use that later with uh, Spark Plug with some Thunder action. That might be fun. And Surf gets a power up too. Yeah. I saw this really cool... Um, some artwork today on Facebook. It was Pokemon Encourage the Cowardly Dog. So it had, like, cur like Courage playing around with, like, um, Charmander, and then Charmander evolves into, like, Charizard, which is, like, a dragon that's chasing him down. Oh. Alright, this thing is gonna know Thunderbolt. I don't, I don't even know if I have any revives. I don't think I do. Alright, this is where we kind of hit a roadblock last time. Yeah. That's what that whole freaking, uh, Nido Queen was for, setting up the Thunders. Well, I got him too! Yeah! Freaking Star- What is Starmie and Star You supposed to be? And don't say Starfish. Starfish cannot summon the Wrath of Zeus! Hi, Raichu. Summon the Storm! That is a good... That, okay, I will admit, that's a pretty good, uh... That is a pretty good catchphrase there. We need some earthquake action up in here. The rain stopped. Butchuckle wow wow! I don't think we made it past the first trainer. I think we did get destroyed by the first trainer last time. I'm pretty sure we did anyway. Yeah, I don't think we made it to the second. I'm level 100 now! It resets back to 1. I'm like, oh crap, I'm level 1, shit! 
You sure know a lot about Pokemon. You're gonna need it to take on the rest of us. But my part is done, so all I can do is wish you luck. Don't let me down now. All right, Robert. You and your chipper attitude. You're supposed to be a member of the Elite Four. You're supposed to be, like, smug and arrogant and shit. Oh, hey, look, Koga's area. Somebody, somebody, uh, I think, I think the previous Elite Four got fired for, like, a drug bust. And, uh, the new Elite Four came in and just remodeled their rooms. So, this, this, this old guy right here. All right. All right, cool. We can just sit down on this bench here. All right, cool. Hi there, uh, hi there. How you doing, old man? The other day, I was in Wal- I was in- No, Walt Walmart. I was in McDonald's. And I used to go into McDonald's, you know, when I got off work at Dollar Tree. And there was always this old guy that sat down at this table and would just be drinking a coffee. Just this old guy. He would drink, like, maybe, like, a few coffees and then leave. And he just looked sad because he, he was never with anybody. It was just him sitting at a table by himself just drinking a coffee. Just people watching, you know? So, it, you know, I don't go into McDonald's as often because I don't work at Dollar Tree anymore. But I was in, I go in there, you know, once every few weeks to get some food. And I was in there the other day and I saw that old guy in there. And I really wanted to just sit down next to him and just talk to him. But I didn't. And I felt bad about that. Next time I'm in there and I see him in there, I, I, I should just sit down next to him and be like, How you doing? You doing good today? How, how's the weather? You know, just, just have a conversation with the old man. <sighs> All right, how you doing? Hey! Eh? Wait! All right, yeah. I'm going to eat for I got some Pokemans through the eons. I have been known by many names, but my true name of power is Doom. Oh. Oh, God. Okay. Is it, like, is it an old guy? Oh, son of a bitch. It's Ned Flanders! Howdly diddly here, neighbor. Oh, crap. We are screwed! We cannot beat the Flanders! Stupid freaking Pokemon Trainer Flanders! Fire Blast it! Helgamesh! Old guy is low key a serial killer. Uh, I think old guy is high key a serial killer there, sir. Diddly diddly, diddly do. Look up, um, oh, I forget what the name of the band is. It's like, uh, Hadley Diddly or whatever. But it's, it's like a heavy metal rock band with just people that dress like Flanders from The Simpsons. Ooh, an Octillery. I've always loved Octillery. Not just because of the name, but the design. It's an octopus. It's a fucking taco. That's Cynthia's theme playing. Oh, it is! I'm not super- Oh no, it's using Octazooka! I love Octazooka. I'll yeah, I don't know why I-, I Sparkplug does not n normally learn Thunderbolt. Um, and you have to learn it from a TM, but I couldn't find the TM. There's a reason why I didn't try to teach it Thunderbolt. I did try, but there's something that happened that I couldn't do it. It's been a while since I played this game. Beedrill's part flying, right? Well, guess we'll find out in a second. Ooh! Ah! Uh, you know what? I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you build this up a little bit. Holy crap! How are you faster than me? Okay. All right. All right. No playing around here anymore. We're done playing around. I told you, level 100 isn't going to guarantee anything. Ah, oh, crap! Ah, oh, crap! What the hell? Ah, oh, I hope I have a revive or a rare candy or something. Burn it! All right, we're going balls deep into this now, guys. If you thought level 100 was going to guarantee anything, <laughs> you are sadly mistaken. We're fighting against Doom right now. Is that a shiny Omni? Okay, I guess it is. It's God. I like the little. Uh, I like the little shiny anime. Was that always there? Did they add it to the game? I never caught him any shinies back in Gen 2, but was that little uh, shiny symbol up there in the original? All right. Uh, rock and water, right? Right? Or just pure water? It's a fossil, so it would be rock and water, right? So, Mandragora. 
It was always there. Ah. Well, you know, I never had many shinies back in when I played Gen 2. I only almost caught one, but KO'd it before I could see anything, so. Giga Drain! Alright. Alright. Well, we lost the electric type. That's not good. Oh, that would have, you know, electric type would really come in handy right about now. Oh my god! I hate you! Diddly do, but then I remember. It's all about the death of you. Alright. It's gonna know a flying type move. I guarantee you it will. I could poison it at risk of dying. Oakley Dokley! Oh yeah, Oakley Dokley. That was the name of the. Oh, this is gonna hurt. All right, not as bad as I thought. I wonder if we could get a freaking sand, not a sandstorm. I wonder if we could get a solar beam out on this. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm just throwing out Helgamesh because he's got crunch. She's got crunch. Time for some crunch. Do you like some cinnamon toast crunch? Helgamesh will burn the sand. Yeah! Go down, neighbor, neighbor, neighborino. Well, gosh darn it, Diddly defeated. I love that they put Flanders in here. Sir Rob, you can go hotly doodly dadly doodly diddly diddly do and get off my lawn! Alright. Uh, do we have a revive? Uh, got some potions we could give. Super potions. Okay. Ah, crap. Wait! Nah, it didn't work. That raised his HP, but that didn't raise it. It's like actual stat. Like, shit. It raised the stat, but it didn't increase the... Ah, crapple facts. Alright. Alright, well... We lost one. Really? This this in lead four is gonna be nothing but a bunch of references, isn't it? Alright, fine, I guess we're playing Mario. I guess we're fighting what, what kind of Pokemon would Mario use now? Uh probably a Carvana, because that's like a piranha plant. Uh let's see here. What Pokemon is shaped like a giant bullet? Mushrooms, so a Parasect. I guarantee it has a Parasect because of the Goombas and the Mushroom Kingdom and everything. Uh the, the Koopas, uh, turtle, flying turtles, I don't know, like a freaking, um, Tortuga? I don't know. Torterra? I don't know, man. Can you stream shirtless? Fun fact, while I was preparing for this stream, I was shirtless, because I was outside mowing the grass earlier, and I came back and took my shirt off, because I was all sweaty. And, uh, yeah, put a shirt on just for this. Hey, God, I've almost beat this level! Oh my god, it's a nerd! Oh, check out all the games he's got. Broken TV. He's got a Wii over here. It's a Wii. It's covered in dust. <laughs> That's so true, though. The, the Nintendo Wii. I remember, I mean, some of you guys might be really young. Like, if you're like... I mean, you even if you're like a teenager right now, you probably remember when the Wii came out. The Wii came out in 2007. Everybody was losing their shit over the Wii. Because it's like, oh, you move and stuff. And and after, like, it didn't take very long for the hype to die down. Um, I had a Wii, but my house is so freaking tiny, I couldn't play it in my room. And even our living room was kind of, like, we had too much crap in our living room, so I couldn't really move around very much with the Wii, you know? 
I remember I, um, after having my Wii, I had it for, like, I, I played it for a little while. There was a Bleach game called Bleach Shattered Blade on the Wii that I played. But that was really the only thing I played. I had Castlevania, a Castlevania game, Dawn of Shadows or something. I played that a little bit. Didn't finish it. I made it about halfway through Twilight Princess on the Wii. I should have just got it for the GameCube, honestly. But anyway, so I had the Wii for a while, got tired of it, threw it in a desk. Probably, like, five years later I had it, you know, like 2012. It was, like, in my desk drawer or whatever. And I got it for Christmas. My mom bought it for me for Christmas. I wasn't playing it anymore. I had a friend that offered to buy the Wii for 50 bucks. And I'm thinking, that's not bad because, you know, I'm not using it. I haven't played it in years. And you're not going to get more for it. I tried to sell it, and my I was looking for it, and I was uh, pulling it out. My mom was like, what are you doing with the Wii? And I'm like, oh, I'm selling it to a friend. And she's like, how much are they giving you? I'm like, 50 bucks. I'm like, I paid $200 for that. You are not selling the Wii for 50 bucks. 200 I'm like, mom... I was, like, trying to explain to her how the value of video game consoles don't exactly, you know, like, that's that's not how this works, you know? Um, so, uh, yeah, I, I, I she wouldn't let me. I, she just wouldn't let me grab it, you know, so. I still have it. It's lying around here somewhere. This is an N64, isn't it? Yeah. X64 drive, sweet. NES, good, good choice. And that's a SNES over here, I would assume. A SNES. It's a SNES. A lot of use. Oh, yeah. A trophy. The inscription says, Crystal Clear 2018, 250 Con Award, first place. Oh, that's... That's that's something. You must be super proud of yourself. Okay. Well, let's rock and roll, guys. And done. I am Fibif of the Elite Four. <laughs> I'm giving him a man-dark voice for some reason. I'm a bit of a jack-of-all-trades, but I have spent many years training Pokémon. As a kid, I would train Pokémon until my thumbs bruised red or blue. Okay, so in this dimension, Pokémon exists, but there's also the Pokémon video games that also exist that are about the world that they currently live in. Wouldn't that kind of be like you could play a Nintendo game where you could just get a dog or a cat and then make other dogs and cats fight against it? Like, not Pokemon. Like, uh, imagine a Pokemon game, but you literally go outside, like, it's like the normal world in the game, and you just capture dogs and cats and birds and bugs and just make them fight each other. That, I mean, yeah, it would be kind of like The Sims, except I don't think you could dogfight in The Sims. I don't think there's, like, a dogfighting DLC in The Sims, you know what I mean? Let's see you bust something out. Oh, I'll bust something out on you. I am so wroth! Really? You're really going with... Okay! Fuck it! This is the most fun I've had so far. Let's rock! Come on, Fibif! Anderson! Yeah, I know. It's the Oompa Loompa theme. I don't... Whatever. Alexander Anderson. The Seraphim sing for you. Forden. Alright. You know what? Fuck it. Yeah! Ah! Oh, Charvel! Normal type. Let's just flamethrower it. It's gonna use conversion. Bring it on! I love how Porygon, like, bounces its chest when it gets here. My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. Okay. Let's do this. Dog pound. Oh, you dastard. I think he's using all of the fully evolved... Because in this game, you can pick multiple starters. You can pick, like, Porygon as a starter. Smurgle as a starter. You can pick freaking um, Abra as a starter. I think that's what his he's doing here. Copycat, yeah. Fire blast it! 
Oki. Yeah! My fire burns hotter than yours. This thing is gonna kill me. Oh boy. I don't feel comfortable with this thing. It's gonna use, like, metronome, explosion, berserk gene, I... It's like the Magikarp all over again. It's like... Fire blast it. No, they don't all have shinies. It seems like each one has a shiny, though. Oh, thank God. I was kind of curious, though, as to what it would have done if I wouldn't have killed it in one shot, you know? Shot down. Seems like you've got the skills, my friend. Ah, ha, 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 ha. All right. Well, keep on playing your games, bro. Keep it up. What's the next theme? Oh, are we going surfing? Surfing USA. I think we're good. I am Honey Bun of the Elite Four. Many years ago, I too challenged the Elite Four. Here, you want a Honey Bun? I imagine he just has like a pack of honey, like a messenger bag full of Honey Buns. Here, you look like you're, you, you look like you need a snack. Here you go. Sakazuki appears. Oh man, there should be a One Piece mod of Pokemon. You have to fight all the admirals. Oh boy. Okay, what, what song's this now? This is... This sounds like the theme that played in Pokemon the first movie. Like the sad song. The sad one, remember? Gengar. Oh, this is not going to be fun. I guess the Yonko could be the Elite Four. Yeah, that would make sense. Down! You think you can take me on? Apparently you can! Or I guess you can. All right. Well, then everything's good. All right, then. Sweet. He gives you the honey bun to lower your guard. You're busy eating the honey bun. You're like, oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh well, your accuracy sucks, bro. Crunch it. Ooh, I wish I would have saved a Fire Blast for you. It might know- oh, it might know Earthquake. Hopefully this kills it in one hit. Alright, that's good. Woo! Why is it hair across question mark explanation? Well, no, it's just a hair across question mark. Why does it have a question mark? Is this thing going to turn out to be a ditto or like a... Uh, I, 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 I'm scared of this thing. What's going to happen when I kill it? If I kill it? Alright. Okay. Does he have seven Pokemon? I'm going to have to... Oh... Kermit. Just because it's my it's probably no slow bro. It's gonna no freaking surf or something. Not good, but not the worst, I guess. Who? There we go. 
Please freeze. You don't have to freeze, but if you froze, that would be lovely. Oh, I think it knows left it has leftovers shit. If I if I still had spark plug, I could rain dance thunder. It hasn't shown off a water move yet, but that might be for good reason. Okay, it has Psychic, so I can't throw out Mandragora. Uh, if it has a water move, that would fuck up Helgamesh and Aerosmith. Nuxal would... Well, I mean, Nuxal wouldn't be affected... It wouldn't be super effective for Psychic or... Thunder Wave would suck, sure, but... Alright. Even when it's dead, Spark Pug looks adorable. This shouldn't be... This shouldn't kill. Yeah, we're good. Special D cell. That's not good. Oh! I could try it! Yes! 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 Damn it! Fuck you! I don't have any of those. I don't have any money. Okay, it does have a water move. All right. Well, at least I found that out. I could just fly it. Oh. Shit. Hmm. This is getting a little tricky. The music is so chill. That's a, that was a, oh that wasn't a crit. That was because of stab. All right. Uh. Ooh, that does a lot of damage. Yes. Oh come on. Uh, it has leftovers, too. <sighs> or something to replenish itself. Probably leftovers. Ah! Yeah, Nuxout might die. Yeah, I've noticed. Okay, it's got Psychic, Thunder Wave, Surf, and... One more move. Yeah. This might kill it. Oh! Oh, come on! Alright, I'm gonna die. Alright. I gotta hope that I get lucky with the crunch. That's all I have to go on here. Yes! Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Yes! Thank God! That might not have worked, though, if it was at full health. Woo! All right. What's next? Daddy. Oh. Oh, you're a big daddy, aren't you? Oh, I hate you. Oh, hi there, daddy. How are you today? Uh, what do you guys think here? Yeah, I thought that too. I hope it burns. I hope it does. This is Big Daddy, and he just got home after drinking. Oh. Body slam! Ah, oh, I didn't get paralyzed. Good. Alright, I think we're alright. Oh. That was rough. All right, now, is there a champion after this? Because if so... Oh, oh, no. There is. Crap. All right. I should have figured. All right. Hold on. Use these super potions here. Use some water. Give you some water. I'm going to get everybody... Everybody that can be full power, I'm going to get them full power here. Kermit. 
Man's Ragora. All right. Man, even level 100, man. I'm telling you. I have no idea who you are, but you look chill. Oh, it's the creator of the damn game! I should have known they were going to go all meta with this crap. All right, all right, all right. It's going to have, like, Welcome, Sir Roth. I hope you enjoy my team of six Mewtwo's. <laughs> I have all of the legendary dogs and ho ho -Oh and Lugia. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, guys. We're we're going for it. We're going for it. We're going balls in. Quite a piece of work you've accomplished. I'm impressed. To reach me here is no small feat. Behind me and in front of you are the doors leading to the last room. Behind me and in front of you. That doesn't apply here, dude. You know what? If I was the Pokemon League champion, I complain that there's too much text, they're talking too much, but... Come on now! If you were the Pokemon League champion, and a challenger walked in, you know, you have this badass throne room all to yourself, you'd be like, Welcome to my domain. I'm pretty damn awesome. You'd be a little arrogant too. Alright. Let's rock and roll. Oh boy. Oh no, he's wearing a jacket over his shoulders! We are totally fucked! Champion SS. Okay, well, I don't need to know about your your political allegiances here, okay? Hey, I used to have one of those! No. Crunch it! Crunch, crunch! Alright. Zeus is such a cliche name for an electric type. Alright, that's a little bit more clever. Shiny Cloyster. Hmm, wish I had an electric type. Alright, Cloyster's uh, special defense is garbage. So... Something that can crack its special D. Uh Ah oh man, I should have unparalyzed Kermit. Man, I love this theme, man. Yeah, this is Mega Man, isn't it? Yeah, this is Mega Man X. Um let's see. Aerosmith is rock, so water's not good. Kermit I don't think I I don't think Kermit has anything that could really hurt it. Uh, Mandragora, uh, ice attacks would not be fun. I mean... Time for Sir Roth to become the ultimate Pokemon champion. You know what? Mandragora hasn't gotten any options here. Hopefully, because Helgamesh is fire, hopefully he'll use a water type move on Mandragora. Spikes! Okay, that's not good, but it, it could be worse. Giga Drain! That's special, right? Yeah! Alright, Mandragora, there's spikes everywhere, so we're gonna see if you can be locked in here. Mandragora! Pudge. Oh, it's a. Oh, you've thrown out a literal wall. That's nice. Ha ha ha! I will poison your wall, sir! This might take a while. Oh no, I can't, I can't put it to sleep. I don't know why I tried that. I don't think I've ever seen the heel bell animation. Ah, oh, crap. You've thought of that, you bastard! Absorb its essence! Holy shit. Of course! 
Why wouldn't you have Ice Beam? Why not? GATHER THE POWER OF THE SUN! Kamehame! Oh my god! Yeah, I gotta get a physical attacker up in this bitch. I'm gonna take spike damage, but... Trying to see who has the highest physical attack. Probably Helgamesh. Oh, no! Aerosmith does. Yeah. BAM! Yeah! Take that, you wall! Oh, it's gonna be- I- 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 I was gonna be like a freaking Gojira! Gojira! BOOM! Earthquake- Earthquake is like the best move. It's super effective on everything. Can you think of one Pokémon that isn't super effective, isn't weak to Earthquake? I can't. That's gonna hurt. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Burr! Uh, 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 uh. Flying types are immune to Earthquake. Technically not super nor not very effective. They're just immune. That was... Saber. Ooh, I got the perfect thing for you. Watch it knows like surf somehow. Saber. Still we. I always thought say I always thought um Scizor looked like a freaking robot, you know. I wish I had some fire blasts left, but this'll have to do. My god, I would love for him to come out and be like, you used the cheat code, didn't you? Topple... Top... Top... Alright, whatever, it's another steel type. I'm killing it. Okay. So you're, uh, you're, you're lawful neutral, that's great. Burn it. Top lettuce. I get it. Okay, I get it now. Took me a while. That was my last Pokemon. Yay! We did it! We cheated our way to the top, guys, and we still somehow lost two Pokemon. Oh... Oh, boy. Uh-oh. What the hell? Oh, here we go. Mega Man themes! No! It's the Swin Up! It's gonna be level 100, isn't it? No, level 70. All right. Ice type. Ice ground. Ugh. Flyer! Flame! Blurb! 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 We did it! The fuck? Uh, why didn't you stop it? You bastard. I am the champion. I do not take kindly to this Pokemon attacking me in my throne room. That was easy. Yeah. 
Oh. Oh, okay. Alright, I see how it is, you freaking tsundere piece of shit. Man, just feel the atmosphere in here. There's absolutely nothing in this room but a giant computer and a laptop. Yeah? I do. I went through a whole adventure, I cheated, and I managed to get here to the top. That's what winning's all about. Cheating your way to the top. I kind of knew that you'd make it. I'm proud of you for accomplishing this victory. Anyway, yeah. As soon as you're ready, place your Pokemon up on that machine. You don't tell me what to do. Don't, don't. So what does it mean to be champion? Oh, that means you gotta live here in this building and just uh, not leave premises and be stuck here for all time. That sounds like it would really suck. What if I want to go on vacation? You can't. You're the champion. All right. Shit. Helgamesh. Ah, uh, we've been through a lot, guys. We've been through a lot, but we finally made it. We did it. Victory screech. <laughs> Spark plug, you didn't do much during the final run, but man, I love you, man. Alright, here he is. So rough with my incorrect color palette. I'm the fucking champion, Oak! I don't care what you say to me. Yeah, let's hit it! Dancing dittos! Okay. All right. Whoa. All right. So. That was a thing we did. All right. Uh, Want to go kick the shit out of all the gym trainers now? Let's go kick the shit out of all the gym trainers now. <laughs> Who are we starting with? Who's going to be the first to feel our wrath? Uh, who haven't we battled yet? Oh, Surge. Surge, you're gonna be the first one to feel death. You're going down, Surge. You're gonna be leveled, Surge. I don't have time for you bastards. I want Surge. I want Surge! Surge! Get your ass out here, Surge! Dragon Breath! Just torch the entire freaking gym. Just destroy it. Yeah! All right, now give me a second so I can go heal and get back all my earthquakes. And then I'm coming back, Surge! Yeah, who are we going to save for last? Because whoever we save for last is going to be the strongest gym. Could you play the next Pokemon game normally, but with no training off-screen? I've tried that before, guys. It's just, it's too much work. It would be like, I would be stuck doing this for, like, way longer than I would want to. I don't want to really play it for longer than a few months. I don't want to get burned out. If I played the game normally, so I would have to, like, grind, like, normal, like a normal Pokemon game. And I do, like, oh my god, it's Guile's theme! Oh my god! Yes! It goes with everything. I don't even want to skip over it because it's Guile's theme. What do you got, Surge? You got a Magneton? Well, too bad. 
Gen 3 is a long way away, and there ain't no levitate or magnet rise bullshit. Giovanni's not in this, it's blue. I mean, he might be in it somewhere, but he's not the gym trainer. Why do you have a Porygon 2? I guess it's a digital Pokemon, that's the reason why. Boom! Red is not a gym trainer, guys. I'm saying gym leaders. Red is not a gym leader in this. I guess we'll save Faulkner for last. Yeah, Faulkner's gonna have, like, the legendary birds and shit, I think. I think he does. Just getting started. I have my Pokemon in the war. Man, I wish there was a Pokemon war game. You know, like, a game actually takes place during the Pokemon war. That'd have been pretty cool to see, you know? Alright, we got a Dunda Badge. Oh, sweet, we got Zap Cannon. Alright, it's shitty accuracy, but, uh, we already have Thunder. I guess we don't need to teach it Thunder... I mean, Zap Cannon, because we already know Thunder. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We already... We already established this. Yeah, I'm already the champion. All right. Who's next on my death list? <sighs> Who else haven't we defeated? Erica! Quit smoking your reefer! I'm coming, Erica! Don't think that these buildings are located in these precarious locations. You're gonna stop me. I'm gonna burn your gym down. I'm on a warpath. In the news today, a local champion has gone crazy by defeating everybody in a massive hellstorm of pure, unrepentant pain and misery. He's fighting everybody. None can stop him. He is the simply the strongest creature we've ever known. Is he even human? The answer is, of course, no. Erica, I'm coming for you. Lovely weather we're having today. Ie tenki desu ne. Ie. Bring it! This theme isn't as interesting. I'm just gonna speed through Erica. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead. Oh, a jump bluff, that's cool. And a Venusaur, you're all dead. All right. I already have Giga Drain. You're useless to me. You're nothing to me, Erica. He's not a human! Who's next? Oh, you know who's next? You think you're safe just because you're blue? Oh, you're not safe. You're going down, down. I'm bringing it around town, Blue. You think I'm gonna save you for last? I lied. Yo, finally here! Yeah, I'm finally ready to kick your ass! Oh, bad decision. Rhydon, yeah, Kermit, go. Surf, dead. Alakazam, you know what? Blizzard, dead. Pidgeot, yes. Sparkplug, thunder, dead. Arcanine, thunder. Okay, I missed that, but, you know, you got one shot. Alright, Kermit, surf. Dead! Blastoise! Dead! Yeah! You're nothing to me, Blue! You're a piece of shit, Blue! The only person I care about, the only person in this game that can give me a true challenge is Faulkner! That is the only trainer that's worthy! Faulkner! Alright? Ah! Oh, he destroyed the gym! There's nothing that can stop him! Oh, you think you're safe just because you're over here? Freaking Price? Hey, Price, you think you're safe just because you're over here in uh, Johto? You heard the story about everybody killing everybody over in freaking Nakanto? Oh, you're not safe, buddy. Not by a long shot. I'm gonna go heal, I'm gonna come back into this freaking ice skating rink, this sorry excuse that you call a gym, and I'm gonna melt every little detail, even the stone. It's going down. I'm not very good at smack talk, 
but I don't need to. I have a team of level 100 Pokemon. Oh, you got a Deli Bird. That's adorable. That Deli Bird is adorable, sir. Everyone's gonna die. Update the badges. There's not even a point to that at this point. Alright, how do I do this again? I used to be able to do this. This isn't a hard puzzle. It's really not. I, uh, hold on. Alright, I fought against every... After I finish this, this, this puzzle, I'm gonna kick your ass, Price. You're going down, Price. Price. You better, you better take your medication, you old man. Because you're gonna... There you go. You're going down, Price. Sneasel. Cloister. I'm gonna crunch that cloister. Lapras. Oh, that's adorable. Bam! You gong! Gong! Ugh! Oh, an Articuno! All right. Oh, that's, uh, you know what? You don't get to see the Legendary Birds Gen 2 sprites that often, you know, because you don't, I don't think there's, there's no way in the actual game, Gold, Silver, and Crystal, you can actually encounter the Legendary Birds. You got to get them through trading, which I never had any friends growing up, so I could never use the time capsule with my friends. But, um, yeah, Articuno's, I think Zapdos. I remember seeing Zapdos's sprite in Gen 2. I think Red might use Zapdos against you. Maybe that's why I recognize Zapdos' sprite. But I never remember seeing Articuno's sprite. It looks pretty good. Oh well, it's dead. Uh, 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 we must warn the rest of the land. He's a monster. Alright, who's next on the hit list? Uh, let's see, who else we got here? Who's next? Uh, Claire or... Shit, what? Olivia? Olivia? Is that her name? Jasmine. I don't know why. Where did I get Olivia from? Jasmine. Don't worry, Faulkner. You're the only person that's a real threat to me. So I'll save you for last. Hold on. I'm gonna flip a coin here. We got a... Uh, I have a, uh, a 500 yen coin that somebody sent me. Alright. Heads, Jasmine. Tails, Claire. Tails. Claire. Fate just decided that you are dead. Fate just decided that it is your time. You know what? That's a good thing. Because, you know, Claire's cool and all. But, you know, she does that stupid thing where she's like, I'm not going to give you the badge until you go into the Dragon Den. We should check out the Dragon Den after this to see what's up. If there's anything going. Like, we could, like, fight Lance in there or somebody. Oh, this is different. This is usually lava. I like this design. Can I surf here? I guess I can't. Ooh, they can take more. I can't kill them with one shot anymore. Well, I could with that Lapras. I'm coming for... Whoa! Okay! You're getting me a little bit, uh... You're getting a little bit antsy here. But you can't hold off the inevitable forever, Claire. I'm coming, Claire. Oh, Garo time! Aw, oh, man, I should be playing Gar- Oh, I should have started that years ago. All right, so Poke Mixer, he's a YouTuber. He makes uh, remixed versions of uh, themes, and he has a Garo theme, and I have it on my phone, and it's such, it's such a good remix. Let me cue that up. Let me cue up the Garo theme for this. And let me pop Poke Mixer's link in the description. Because he's, uh, he's a really he's a really cool guy. He won't uh, get mad at you if you use his stuff as long as you put links to stuff. So he's pretty chill with that. So let me just pop a link in the description. And um, then I will get back to it. But yeah, I need to play Garo's theme for this. That, that would work so well. Thanks to Poke Mixer. Poke Mixer 92. And give it a second for it to update. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, boy, yeah. I'm going to actually mute the game's audio in favor of that. That would be way better. That would be, that would fit way better for this.
Okay, here we go. You're going down, Claire. Dawn, Dawn. Oh, they've all been defeated, sir. There's nothing we can do. <sighs> you will all fall. After what happened last time, I will not taste defeat any longer. Dragon Knight or no, it net matters not. I don't care if you have a Gyarados! It's your time, Claire. <laughs> oh, hey, Joy. What's up? We're on a murder spree. Bring it. Crunch. It'll, oh wait, is it not gonna play again? I right, hope. Okay. There we go. All right, I'll set it to. Uh... There it is. Okay. What's next? Oh, <laughs> you can't stop us. I'm tired. It's okay, Joy. You don't have to comment. It's all right. Oh, I meant to use thunder, but that's okay. Oh, you defeated one of us. Do you think you're going to win because of that? The answer is no. Yes, you lost, Claire. And now I absorb your magic power! All right, who's next, Jasmine? Oh, no. Oh, it's such a lovely city you have here. Get out of my way, sailor. It would be a shame if someone destroyed its gym leader. I mean, I mean, I mean, I'm only talking about destroying a gym leader in the context of defeating her. I would never do anything, you know. J Jasmine's actually a very nice woman. She's, she's very kind. She's very caring. She cares about sick Pokemon, you know. She's, she's a nice person. But I am going to destroy her team. One step closer to Faulkner's. Faulkner is the ultimate. Dead... Dead. Ooh. Mm -hmm. It's over. All right. There's only one trainer left in all of Kanto. I mean, Johto. And uh, we're going to be saving him for last. Don't worry, Faulkner. Your time's coming. Oh, wait, no! Oh, that was the last one! Oh, okay! I'm going to bed. Bye, Joy! Good night! Hope you have a good sleep there, buddy. Oh, man. Yeah. I think that's everybody. Alright. So I guess we're good then. Alright, guys. Final battle music. We need final battle music. Um, oh, I got I got a good theme we could use for final, bat final battle music. Final battle music. Blah, 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 blah.
I'm going to queue it up here. All right. I got some good Final Battle music themes. All right, all right, all right. This is like an 8-bit kind of theme. It's like a 60. It's from an SNES game, so it's kind of like a 16-bit sort of feel to it. I'll play it when we get to Faulkner. Okay, guys, here we go. Here we go, guys. You missed one. No, I didn't. I didn't miss any. We're going as Faulkner. That's the last battle. Yeah, everybody's defeated. All right, good. All right. Here we go. Violet City. The home to the most badass trailer this side of Mount... And a Pidgeotto. I don't think either of those are level... Are, like, more than level 10. I think they're super... Like, they're... I think he has the lowest level Pokemon out of any gym leader. Is Faulkner. When you first battle him in Gold and Silver and Crystal. He is... I don't know about Crystal, but I know Gold and Silver. He is weak as shit. So... This is it. The final battle. He's gonna have a lot of birds. I like birds. So, Spark Plug, we're gonna lead with you. This is gonna be it. Alright, now, we're probably gonna have to fight our way through some bullshit trainers and stuff. Yeah, okay, well... Oh. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Why are they not fighting me? Do they know? They've they've heard it on the news. This kid do Oh, okay. Weird. Maybe I fought that guy earlier? I don't remember. He's dead. Togetic. Oh, that's a cool co Togetic. All right. All right. This is this is a serious battle here. We cannot just rush headlong into this guy. All right. We cannot. We will get destroyed. This is the strongest gym leader we will ever face. I bet he has a ho-ho. I'm going to bet he has a ho-ho, all the legendary birds, a Lugia. If, okay, if he had all legendary birds, a ho-ho, and a Lugia, what is the last, what's the last badass flying type he could have in Gen 2? He could have a, um, that's like a legendary. I don't think there's any more legendary Pokemon that are flying type. Ho-ho, Lugia, legendary birds. I don't know, man. But we're going to go into it in a Pidgey. Ho, 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 ho. And a Deli Bird. Three legend... Guys, okay. Three legendary birds. Ho, ho, a Lugia, and a Deli Bird. Yeah. All right. Bye, Teching. Bye, Joy. Have a good one. Here we go, guys. Are you ready for the epic theme? I'll play it as soon as the battle starts. I am Faulkner. The Violet Pokemon Gym Leader. I can see that you've been battling well. Well, guess what? I am your final battle. It's time to show you true might of the birds. The birds! The birds! Here we go! Ah! Oh, God. They're all level 70 or higher. Ugh! Yeah! Critical hit! Oh, yeah! I knew you were good. This is gonna be an electric battle for the. No, no, you stay in. You're staying in! Let's do this! Calling down the thunder! Yeah! Okay, you missed. Ah! 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 Yeah! There we go. Ah, come on, spark plug! You gotta hit it. Ugh. Come on, spark plug! Do it! Yeah! What's next? A mole trace? Gliger. All right. Is 
It's too strong! Oh no! Oh boy, it's glowing! Oh no, he's making a whirlwind. Yeah! Deep freeze! Yeah! Bring it on, Faulkner! Oh! It'll play again. Come on! A Dodrio. <gasps> Spark plug, no! You will be avenged, sir. You will be avenged. Come on, yeah. Defeated. Alright. Well, you were the only gym leader that managed to KO one of my Pokemon. So you, you, sir, you are the true master. I do not deserve your Zephyr badge. I do not deserve such an honor. Oh, boy. Alright. Mud Slap. Oh, yeah. Well, that redeemed Faulkner. Okay. That was a worthy opponent, yeah. The Fast Fairy. Well, okay. See, this is the thing about this game. There's so much stuff in this game. Hold on. Somebody told me to go to Cherry Grove for something. Let me try some here. All right. Like, for example, like... Uh, no, not New Bark Town. Cherry Grove. Like, in the original game... You could surf here, and you would just go to an island. I don't think it's anything significant. But, in this game... I think you can go further. Yep. This is not in the original. Yeah! That's putting me in a weird place. Ooh. A mystery cave. Well, we gotta go in. Ooh. Mystery cave. Ah, shit. We need waterfall. I think we have waterfall. Ghastly. Do we have any repels? Uh, no repels, really? Alright. Oh, we found some calcium! Somebody just left a jar of calcium lying in a cave. Alright, cool, that's nice, whatever. Eh. Uh. I don't think it would let me use Rock Smash, even if it was available. From the way that said that. Yeah, we should go to Mount Silver. I don't know why I'm dicking around in here. Oh, okay. Oh, is it that guy again? That guy with the deadly Magikarp? My ducks are uncontestable. Yes! You bet your ass they are! Level 100 Gold Duck. Bring it on! Why are you... His name is Colgate. I... I can't. I, I, I can't even at this point. Oh. A free cat? 
I, I don't want your cat. Puppy? I think Colgate, I think he might be a little bit... I think his, uh... His brain might be running on only a few guinea pigs less than the necessary amount. You know what I mean? Oh, boy. Oh, that's right. You're... Oh, it's a Dawn fan? I thought it was a Growlithe with the way it looked. Minion. Oh, get it? Minion? Okay, that's pretty funny. <coughs> Arby's. And ghastly. It's gonna be... It's gonna be something that's not a ghastly. It's gonna be like a mischievous or something. <laughs> a shiny Celebi. Celebi's, uh... Gen 2 sprite looks kinda... She looks kinda like, uh... Like she's doing a photo shoot or something. Like she's a model or something, you know? Oh well. I'm gonna freeze her. Alright, well that was a thing. That was a thing that we did. Mm. Are we just stuck up here? Can we not go down? I guess not. Oh, that's where that was. Alright. Alright, we should go fight Red. Or maybe not Red, but somebody that is possibly related to Red. I actually don't know who it's going to be. Oh, shit. How do you get to Mount Silver again? Oh, I know. You have to go to the, uh... The, the original way you do it is you go to Indigo Plateau. And you have to go... Victory Road isn't that long. You have to get out of Victory Road. Oh. Okay. Oh, sweet. A full restore. I do have more money. I could buy full restores, but... Champions do not need full restores. They have all that they need. I think this is the first level. I think the entrance is right down here. Yeah. Alright. This will lead to Mount Silver, I believe. Yep. Woo, lad! There's so much grass here! I only made it a few steps before a high-level Pokémon appeared and wiped me out! Then what are you doing here, man? You need to get to a Pokémon Center staffed! Your, your Pokémon are dying! Let's see what high-level Pokémon he's talking about. Oh boy, a high-level Tangela. Oh yeah, level 39 Tangela, that's cute. Oh, a Scizor, that's neat. Mostly Tangela's, though. Oh my god. Ah! Uh. Guys like to be annoying just to be annoying, don't you? Alright. Uh, I guess I should... Well, did I? Yeah, I guess I should heal. Alright. What about you, lady? Trainers who seek to climb Mount Silver? Hmm. Well, we can go anywhere. We are the strong. I mean, those those trainers didn't know what they were talking about. Did those trainers have a level 100 Politoed? I think not. All right. Here we go, guys. Probably should have bought some Max Repels for this, but I didn't because I was extremely... Well, actually, hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on a... Hold on a French second. Okay, I can fly back to Silver Cave. Okay, cool. Let's go buy some Max Repels. Uh, I don't know... Uh, Blackthorn might have them. Ooh, no, but they sell full restores and... Ethers, Max Revive, Revive, Max Repel. Here we go. Yes. Give me all of them, sir! I don't need money. I'm the champion. Alright. I just bought 91 max repels, just because I could. Alright. Ah! 
Damn you, ledge! Escape Rop. Alright. Aw, oh, man. I think you need Waterfall in the original game to go fight Red. So I'm hoping... I don't need it for this. I'm hoping. And might as well grab it. And that's just another Ultra Ball. Oh, nope, here we are. All right, I wonder who it's going to be. I wonder who it's going to be, guys. It's, it's going to be Professor Oak, maybe. I don't need repels and no longer. Oh, okay, I guess I did. Helgamesh, I feel comfortable putting you out front. All right. Is it red? It looks like red. Is it brown? Ellipses, ellipses. Is it red? Is it just red? Okay. No, it's gold. Yep. All right. We're fighting gold. We're doing it. They, they might very well just have all level 100s, too. Is there any challenge here for me? We shall see. Crunch it, Helgamesh. Crunch the Togetic. Oh, you could take it! They took it! Fighting gold! It's gonna be Joy. <laughs> the final battle against Joy. Gyarados. Spark plug, I summon you! Oh, a red Gyarados! That's cool. Oh, because of the Lake of Rage. So I think it's supposed to be like, you know, in the game that you play it, you know, red, the original silver and gold, you play as gold. You go and you defeat red. And then red just teleports away and you just stay on top of the mountain and then fight against anybody that comes up. So you become the next, you know, ma master of Mount Silver. So I guess that means after we're done with this, I get to spend the rest of my life on top of a mountain. That's lovely. Giyaya Rados. I'm getting hungry. I feel like eating some magnanium today. Actually, I'm not really much of a vegan. Okay, if you ate, if you killed and ate the magnanium, would you be still considered a, a vegan? There's a plant growing right out of it! So, ooh, a Typhlosion. Oh, you're gonna have all the Johto starters, I would assume. No, you are not considered a vegan. Yes, you are. I'm getting some 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 conflicting reports here. This is clearly a trap. He's like, I don't want to be stuck on this mountain anymore. I'm tired of eating freaking Lavatar meat. I just want to go home. <laughs> I'm done with Pokemon. Just take it. It's like after you defeat them, like a magic spell binds you to the top of Mount Silver. Like you cannot leave even if you wanted to. You're bound there for all time. Umbreon. That's its evolution. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll leave you out there. I'll blizzard the uh, Umbreon. No Magnadium is alive. Ooh! Not bad there. What about this, though? Ooh, that's right. You're a dark type. Oh, this Umbreon... It knows its stuff. I'm hungry. I'm gonna go get a burger after this. I'm gonna make myself a teching burger. See, the secret to making a good teching burger is you gotta toast your buns. If you don't toast your buns, the whole burger just falls apart. What's its last Pokemon? It's gonna be... No, it didn't use for Alligator yet. It's gonna be for Alligator. Yeah, for Alligator. I thought it was gonna be, like, Lugia or something. Calling down the thunder! Gotta toast those buns, man. 
Gotta toast them buns. He killed Mr. Steak. I did. All right, are you gonna just give me the ellipsy treatment? Also, oh my god, it's horrible. The people that are bound to Mount Silver get their voices taken away from them. They can no longer speak. I feel your suffering. Okay! We did it! Now, there are other things to do in this game. But, yeah, I'm kind of hungry. So, I'm gonna get going now. I defeated the Elite Four. I beat all the gyms. We slew the, the greatest threat to Pokemon kind. And we became the greatest threat to Pokemon kind at the same time. And uh, we defeated uh, Red. I mean, Gold. So, yeah. That's the case. All right. Well, have a good one, everybody. I hope you enjoyed. I was glad I was finally able to get done with this. Um, yeah, that's just one thing that was kind of bugging me that I never got around to. But now it's officially done. Have a great one, everybody. Techie 101 signing out.